Hello, I'm Dr. Govind Nandakumar. I'm a gastrointestinal surgeon at Manipal Hospitals, Bangalore. Today, I'd like to tell you about inflammatory bowel disease. I'm a surgeon who has a special expertise and interest in taking care of patients with inflammatory bowel disease. Inflammatory bowel disease includes the entities of Crohn's and ulcerative colitis. Crohn's is a disease that largely can affect any portion of the gastrointestinal tract whereas ulcerative colitis is focused on the large intestine which includes the colon and the rectum. As a surgeon, we have a variety of modalities that we can use to treat patients with advanced Crohn's and ulcerative colitis. The surgical treatment for ulcerative colitis is quite straightforward. We need to remove the colon and the rectum and with advances in surgery we have the ability to recreate a rectum with the small intestine so that patients can continue to do, use their normal mode of defecation. Surgery for Crohn's disease is a little bit more complex and individualized. It depends on the type of stricture the patient presents with, type of disease phenotype and the presenting clinical scenario of the patient. A patient with multiple strictures can undergo a bowel saving procedure called a strictureplasty. A patient with multiple fistulas may need a different procedure which includes a resection and a strictureplasty. Whereas a patient with an inflammatory phlegmon may need a resection. Taking care of patients with Crohn's and ulcerative colitis requires the presence of a multidisciplinary team. It requires a good gastroenterologist who is well trained in inflammatory bowel disease. It requires the presence of an active wound care and a stoma nurse. In addition, patients with Crohn's disease can develop anorectal complex fistulas which are generally managed with either cetons or advancement flaps and we try to preserve the muscles in the setting of fistula for Crohn's. Thank you.